Hey guys, it's Nicole, and for this week's nail art look, I decided to do some Moana themed nails because I love the movie. It is so cute. So I used stamping and freehand to create this look with gel polish as well as some art gels and some stamping polish. So I started with Madame Glam's Perfect White, Jolay's Pool Party, and Madame Glam's Fresh Water. So I put the white on my pinky and my thumb, and then the coral on my ring finger, and the blue on my middle finger and my pointer finger. So this is the third coat of color, and I just cleaned up anything that got on my skin before I cured it. And after that was cured, I removed the tacky layer from my middle two nails so I could do some stamping with this Lulo and Moana plate. So I started off with white for Maui's fish hook. I just wanted to stamp the base so I don't have to freehand it. And then I stamped this Moana image as well, which I filled in just with a different, a couple different colors of nail polish. So I started off with black for her hair. Just want to make sure you have enough product on the brush so you don't mess up the image. And then I added in a couple birds because my nail's a little bit long. I needed some extra space filler. Then I mixed a brown and a nude color to create a darker nude shade to fill in her skin. And then I used a coral shade for her top and then a slightly off white for her skirt. So I put that on my middle finger and then I cleaned up the excess and secured it onto my nail. And then I took some black Mission Control Art Gel to outline Maui's fish hook. So I had a lot of product at the bottom of the fish hook, so I kind of just went back and dipped into there so that wasn't too thick and so I could keep the other lines pretty thin. Then I added a little bit of like distressing, I guess. And then I'm taking my glams beyond the sea to start making the heart. So I made the swirl pattern in the middle just with that glittery blue color. And then I'm taking um, two shades of green and white art gels just to outline that and make it look more green because the real one is kind of green and blue. So I wanted to incorporate a lot of different colors. So I outlined one side with a light green and then I did the same thing on the other side with the dark green. And then I took white and added some outlines where I had some space. And once I was done doing that, I just picked up a bit more product to do some dots and a couple little lines because the heart has kind of little bit of printing on it and I did cure between colors also and then I'm doing the hibiscus nail so I started off with some little palm leaves with the dark green and then I flash cured that before taking the light green just to kind of outline it a little bit add a little bit more detail and variation and then I'm taking a corally color that kind of matches on my ring finger to the center of the flower and a hot pink to do the outer edge I try to kind of blend them together, but they look so close. You can barely tell the difference. And next I took false finish after finishing off the middle of the flower. And I applied a coat of that to all of my nails. Once the nail polish was fully dry, of course. And so once that was all cured, I removed the tacky layer. And that's how I created this nail art look. Thanks so much for watching. Um, come back next week to see another tutorial. Bye guys!